We do we have that uh Tim Pool? Uh is that a tweet that you were talking about? Oh yeah, it was just a tweet where he said raise the voting. Uh, let's, pop, let's pop it up. Yeah. Let's pop it up. Uh, oh, we'll yeah. start that and then because I want to get to this fan stuff, but uh because it's interesting uh, theory that um uh Tim Pool is um it's promulgating here. No more voting for Du Bois, only voting for <laughs> Dementia. Well, look at that. And uh, Matthew Film Guy was one of the first guys in uh, to uh, comment on it. Or is that just showing up because you follow him? I don't know. How does that work? Why isn't there all the blue checks before that? Uh, but uh, here's Tim Poole. Raise the voting age to 30. And you know what's amazing about like some of these guys? Like... Um, uh, the views that they get are massive. Like Jill Stein, yeah. she she posted her um, that she's uh, uh, running, and she got like three million views off an account that has the same size as mine. That's a lot of a lot. Did she pay lot. for a check? Mm -hmm. I, oh, maybe maybe I don't. Yeah, probably. That's probably what it is. But um, raise the voting age to thirty. Now let's speculate why he would want to do that uh i think we know why 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 it's all the protests that are pro-terror that's what he I, I i guarantee it's about that but isn't the i mean but it's not just like you you know because presumably if you went to the protest and you were 35 you could still vote uh in his mind and in the minds of his audience they're all uh freshmen in college um you know he doesn't think there's anybody above the age of 30 i think that's generally the impression all these people like to create because i think what he's trying to say is there you you know these people are dumb and uh, they don't have enough life experience and knowledge yeah. and responsibility. And to, they can learn that by to going to Tim Pool's compound skate park at yeah. age 30, hanging out and living on the compound. That's how you get the knowledge as a young person. If you're 18, 19, 20, you know, you need some life experience. You go live on Tim's compound. That's how you know how to vote. Well, you pick up the savviness. Maybe Jim Jordan will be around for around. an interview. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, see, you pick up savviness by sitting around with the boys and having some uh, sush. Yeah. And, he expanded on this but, point. I just I sent, guess, it, sent more of what Tim oh, had he did? to say. Yeah. yeah let's, I, I want to see. Because my guess is he thinks that people under the age of 30 do not have essentially the savvy. I don't know if it would be his word. But I would bet it, it has to do with like intelligence and and uh, common sense, right? Do we have it? I just sent it in our chat. Yeah, yeah. pop it up because I want to see because I have a. Um, I, I think he might be on to something here. Mm -hmm. um, you know, if it, if it really is, let's see. The the stupidest thing is that you have to be thirty five to run for president, but you can be eighteen to vote for president. How does that even make sense? Either raise the voting. Oh wait. No, sorry. I've ever seen. This is one of the dumbest comments yeah. I've ever seen uh, in my life. Is it, he's saying that the level of responsibility and experience that you have to have to be president, to be arguably one of the most powerful people, not arguably, one of the most powerful, if not arguably the most powerful person on the planet yeah. with the ability to, uh, you know, blow stuff up in a way that command an army can't even mm -hmm. can conceive <laughs> is the same as being one of 240 million people, 220 million people who will vote on who should be that person. He's saying it's the same level of responsibility every comment i had about what tim pool had written is out the window because i couldn't even conceive and i yeah i gotta be fair i don't hold tim in the highest regard mm -hmm. and, e and even i with my incredibly low opinion of him could not come up with that stupid of a reason he could pop that back up there this is yeah honestly the stupidest thing is you have to be 35 to run for president, but you can be 18 to vote for president. You know what we should do? We should essentially have, because what, 240 you know, million people or however many people are of those are adults who have the opportunity to vote. We should hold national elections to determine if that person individually has the right to vote. We can just do it one by one, since apparently the responsibility of the average voter is the same as the responsibility of the executive of the United States, yeah. the president. We should have individual elections on every single person's ability to vote. Do you think he just does? He just posts that to get like, yeah, he, he just, just to get to, to 
juice his his uh, payments out of Twitter because it'll get more interaction. Yeah. But you know, he's not in any way embarrassed or thinks. It, what, what's fascinating is that he doesn't think this is going to in impact his audience perspective of him whatsoever no yeah i mean this is on it's honestly genius because he's attracting the dumbest morons who would think something like that is deep um and that's who you want to be milking for content do you think that he realizes that or do you think that he thinks this is a profound idea i think this is just what he's always been doing and it's worked for him and so that's how he just feels like the universe works. and he can't imagine anything else yeah. probably because of a uh, limited uh and also Intellect. because, like, since uh, it's seemingly a response in some way to the reaction to Israel's mass indiscriminate bombing of uh, civilians in Gaza, um, he, you know, he's just coming to this quite recently because when we, I spoke to him in June, um, he said he didn't know enough to comment on the uh, Israel-Palestine conflict or on Israel generally, the top recipient of our military aid, as he said, you know, he was to the left on me of uh, on foreign policy and on war. Says woman who's really not old enough to vote yet i am not isn't honestly it crazy isn't now it, one more year <laughs> isn't it crazy that like kids can ride in cars but like you have to be 18 to drive it like oh that's nuts <laughs> it is sort of nuts it's 60 lower the driving 60 age or raise the passenger it really is. Exactly. yeah, yeah. <laughs> makes yeah. you think what they're like why they're trying to control us yeah pretty pretty messed up